The doctor said I had five days to live. With no certainty of cause this problem, I sit patiently thinking. What my life has been up to now, thinking. Back yesterday, I had an argument with my mother. Told her I hated her and I didn't love her. Now look what's the deal. Day two. I go outside and I see boasters. Haven't told no one my problems, but I felt like a slave. I felt like my young slave, a slave with no ship and no trade. Walked in class, progress for the bad grades, not to kill us. I got four more days to live, no grade of standing can amount to my happiness. Day three, I'm starting to see flashbacks. And as I see the flash of the police watch, the police watch me as I watch my young death clock, watch me as if they had set up their own casket for them. I'd be dead anyway. But they didn't want me dead. Their casket was just a southern bed with my name on it. Day four, I'm still a slave. The demon that has risen in me is still contained. Go away, go away, you don't know me. I can't see you, but you can see me. And these times, these days, I saw a trap. I was in my last period, and the teacher said I got a call. Told me that my mother just clapped in a car collision. Felt like someone just made a decision, a C-section, and my life just gave birth to hell. And I still haven't told my mother I love her. Mm. I'm love, son. Mm. Day five. I'm quiet. I don't want to talk. Demons surround me, playing duck, duck, goose, and I'm it. But I couldn't duck these hits, they constantly try to commit. You're born in one day, you die in one day. You can change in one day. Mm. And what did I do today? Is what I did today worth spent? Is what you did today worth love? Mm. And as I slowly come to my end, I realize my decrease in health. Only to realize that this disease this disease was just myself. I just want to know, in losing um, your brother, um, how has that influenced the evolution of your music? <laughs> Corvus Humphreys, the 20-year-old, was one of two people shot Sunday morning near the CTA Peach Line station on California Avenue in Little Village. Humphreys was shot in the neck, but managed to run across the street to the train station for help. I will never get to see my little bro again. He was only on the surf for 20 years. Damn, still a kid, man, such a trip. Ain't no smile on my face, it's only tears. Losing my brother, that definitely, like, woke me up to the fact that tomorrow is one of the less of a shame, but that's where he was toying. So I am promising him that to back to him. So you know, knowing that the talent and you know potential is cut short, I feel like I had to carry the load. And it wasn't even like a a, a conscious decision. <laughs> yes, I think that's another flush of the new pills because I don't know, I'm a lot more open. Uh, I, I, you know, there's no topic that I feel like I can't talk about because I feel like it's shit. I'm here for how long? Who knows? Fuck it. Let it all out. You know what I mean? Get the work. I made some out of nothing. 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 So, like the first day here, um, I get off. I get to the, you know, to the spot, shower, eat. Then I go straight to the studio. So, I, I wasn't even. Two hours in the house before <laughs> I'm right at work. So we in the city now. On my way to Beach Jill of the Beats. West Side, Chicago, L Town, 400 Block, 400 Band Representative. I think our last joint we did, something like this, similar to this, was uh, 
Peel 3, the takeoff, if I'm not mistaken. I think that was the last joint we did. That's a hot joint, you know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all go check 21 Peels out. Follow him. You're going to see all the projects he done did. The man been putting in some work, you know what I'm saying? The man flew in. He actually called me, I want to say, a week before he came. Man, bro. You think we can... You think we can, uh... Do an album, a little EP or something in a week? He like, hell yeah! <laughs> I know I can too, so we about to see. This evolution part, I get to be an artist for once. Without being behind the scenes, without... You know, that's that's that second love, you know what I mean? That's my side chick that I really love. And I gotta show her some love. So this project, like I said, it's a story. So I'm taking you back to Joe Biden when he was him. You know what I'm saying? Growing up, falling in love with to why 21 Bills 21 Bills. So with this project, I feel like who else helped with that but somebody who helped, you know, in the, in the earlier stages of me becoming who I am as far as like, you know, you know, working together and just doing songs, fucking around and shit and actually being serious about it and still working together. He been there through that journey, so I figured that was the perfect person that uh, be able to tell this story with. The process of making the song with 21 Pills, it's a good process on the strip that we already got like chemistry together. So basically he'll tell me what kind of joint he's looking for, what he been hearing this certain sound. And I think we should come this way, I think we should come that way, and I'll take what he tell me. And I just start going through sounds, putting sounds together, and I come up with a rhythm or something. Instantly he's somewhere in the corner. Look over my shoulder, this dude. I, I know what he's doing once he goes somewhere and he grabbing that. What's that mean? <laughs> he's writing. It, it, he already writing in his head. Like that that's okay. like me. Like if like anybody that know me, him, we don't really do too much writing unless it's like we finna get back to it later or something. If we finna, if we know we finna put it down right now, ain't no need for no pen, no phone, none of that. We just somewhere off in space, la 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 la. That's what I'm talking about. He could also match my craziness. <laughs> Cause like, yeah, I'm like, what's next? Let's go. As soon as I hear the beat, it's, it's on to the next one. Or, oh, I got this idea and this idea. Him, he sneaky, you know, he's like a little, little gopher. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, he like, I got like four bars, what you think? And I'm still messing with the beat. And then once I kind of get like, how he coming? Rest be history, I just go ahead and slap everything around what we just found. Cause all it takes is that 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 rhythm, that melody real quick. Right. And I see how he coming, then I just go with the flow then. That's how we come up with it. Good old home cooking, good old gumbo. So we What drives me? Uh, fear. Fear of not letting what I have in my brain out. Fear of not living how I want to live. Fear of, you know, not, not being as creative or being stifled in the world not being able to hear. My my drive is crazy. That's how I got the nickname the machine. Like me, I'm a motherfucking machine. Damn right I am. I'm a motherfucking machine. Damn right I am. I'm a motherfucking machine. Damn right I am. I just think I love it so much. Damn right I know I love it so much that that's what keeps me right. Working like that, like, like I, I, I said to uh, somebody, like, uh, I shared a new skin when I released this last project. Like before that, I was doing music and I was doing good music, at least in my opinion. But I wasn't doing the stuff that I knew deep inside I should be doing, or like I could be doing. Like, I was doing trying to fit lanes or, or doing stuff that that impress a certain criteria or demo demographic, but. When I, you know, after, you know, a certain situation, it, it, it just, it made me release. It just, 
Yeah, so I feel like now is the time. Because we got like a, a chemistry. He like basically just shoot out some ideas like, man, I want a, a soul food, rock and roll or whatever, you know what I mean? I want one of those joints and I just take what he tell me.
Yeah, no, he got it. I mean, I, I forget. On the couch Look at these dispensaries, another way to keep our people out the street. He tell us over here, he rapping. I'm like, you gotta get on this. Let's see how it's I'm trying to ask you that. Yeah, it's hard to hit through it too, but I'm working through it. Let me just knock the other one out. Mm -hmm. No? That's all the 4K is. That's just the next step up. You know how they got it? Went, think about it. They keep doing the levels. That's gonna be some shit to change on the scale again. It went from uh what is it, two eighty or or three or seven twenty. No, it's four eighty. Four eighty. Four eighty. Seven twenty. Ten eighty. Ten eighty. It's another one on the four eighty though, ain't it? Or three sixty. Yeah, three three sixty. On the real. On the real. So now like terrible. Yeah. Four K is just another that's that best quality Slow shit. Slow your shit down quality. That's that best quality <laughs> shit. No. Yeah, there you go. No, no, no. Oh. Too many mamas mourning, too many murders It's like these niggas killing out of boredom Too many times I tried to get them out and warn them And it's like they wanna go but really, really can't afford it Too many times I hold my head up in anger Too many times I'm look crazy at a stranger Too many times I get on my knees and look to the sky And pray to God to save us, please We can't even trust the police Niggas got guns but don't know peace Going out pills, they walking around sleep Physically and mentally, we don't know what we go and we don't know our history. They got our brainwash, call it mind history. They do that shit the best for our god memory. Look at these dispensaries, another way to keep our people out the street. From Chicago, oh, like a cloud over me, and that's not okay. They say they hope the rain for me, and just watch me do but they don't know. I won't go.
look at these dispensaries. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Cloud. I'm on my 17 letter shit. I'm trying to move the crowd, man. I'm coming on my better shit out of L Town and Venice shit like Edison. That's what I'm on now. I got the gift and the curse, but I gotta leave the gift to my children because niggas doing construction trying to tear down the building. I'm yielding when a nigga should have been shielding. Ah, I almost had that bitch, and I'm yielding. When a nigga should have been shielding, I think I was sent to get a world musical healings, but. You motivates me the most out of all my supporters? Mm. It'd probably be my doubts. It's like, when people say I can't do something, you definitely I'm gonna do that shit. Like, alright, a challenge. A challenge has been thrown at me, and now I gotta prove you wrong. That's fun to me. I don't know if I have as many doubts as I used to. But I create a lot of them so I can keep <laughs> keep going and keep that same passion of I right, let me show them the type of you know, attitude. And right after that, as soon as the song was done, I step out. I was probably like five minutes on the phone. I come in, while I already started to look for the next song. I'm like, oh shit, okay. <laughs> Right, the back to school joints, yeah, the uh, concerts. You remember that shit like that? That's that got me excited. Like I, I always was like, I wanted to be one of them and release my shit too. 
They closed down. With, with, with how today, you know, I guess the convenience of being able to send, you know, a track to someone in another city, another state, country, whatever. I, I can see how good that can be for, you know, keeping the process going, keeping, you know, the stuff going. We can't stop the show. But I feel like it's really important for that personal interaction to be there. I came to Chicago to actually get this project done, along with other stuff, but to get this project done, and we could have done it, you know, as another one of those as I was working on something else. Hey, send me some shit, and I'll just, you know, fit it in. But, nah, nah, I need to get that energy, and, and that's what music is all about, is energy. When you hear it, you get in a certain type of energy that you respond to with your energy, and the world gets, you know, the same type of vibes and shit like that, but, like, if I felt like if I wasn't here with him and the people that I'm collaborating with personally, it wouldn't feel genuine. I got my start just being around it. It's in the blood from from the family, from being outside, till I got old enough to get my own hands on with my own little pieces of equipment. Right. And boom. I just, just took off from there. I just, you know what I'm saying? You know, as you get older, you learn things figure stuff out. I got old enough to start buying my own equipment, start saving my own little money. We can go on like for my story because it's like pieces and pieces and pieces <laughs> and pieces, you know what I'm saying? But it's all about the homeboy 21 pills, man, right now, you know what I'm saying? Well, y'all, y'all eat. You know what I'm saying? Y'all eat. We got some. Baby, we got you. Like, damn, what y'all for the night? That shit was crazy. Oh, baby. <laughs> so, we getting fitted for Big Bro, Big Day tomorrow. So, I took these two days off. I can't. I ain't no working. I look good in my suit. Fuck you, man. <laughs> Yeah, we finna get it in though. Um, happy for him. What's the one with all the celebrities and it was like an earthquake? Um, yeah, that's some shit for you. I'm a dial winner. I was born to win. <laughs> so, I don't know what today's date is, August 4th, August 5th. But this is my big bro's big day, wedding day and whatnot. It's a festival across the street, and I'm staying at the crib he stayed in, he grew up in, for the night I did last night. But this is also where Peel 5, Holes and Butter, a lot of the classics that we released, it's made in this motherfucker right here. That basement right there, like, the union was created here. <laughs> no. Oh, it don't matter, it don't matter how close they are. Ain't another baby, ain't another woman on my radar. I can't wait until I can say that you're my star. And ain't another baby, ain't another woman on my radar. So I don't know how bad I'm gonna get killed today. I broke his cologne. He don't know about it. What you do? So I broke <laughs> Big Bro cologne, right? Damn, oh, this hey man, don't, don't say that word. At least it smells good in here. It, it do. Smell it smell like <laughs> Problem is that was supposed to have been him smelling like this. <laughs> You gonna have to roll around on the floor. Now we done think we bought some expensive pine saw. So, 
to be continued. Yo, 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 yo. 21 DP. You know. Thanks to the problem. I'm 21 Pills. Man, we here at my boy Juan Garcia's wedding. AKA man. Drew Mega. Man, I trust the beat, the, man. The best man well, right nigga there. Nigga clean up good around here. Y'all just see don't it? know how it's we do it. We look nice. Sexy though, and easy. You know what I'm saying? That's what we do. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. So, with that said, yeah, you, know you know what I'm saying? We clean up well. We sitting here actually taking a break, celebrating. You know what I'm saying? Because this right here is like a big day right here for my man. Right? You know what I'm saying? 10 plus years. <laughs> my gosh, you can't even, man. It, 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 we didn't even imagine this day would be today. Crazy. But we happy that this day is today. So, with that said, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Y'all keep in tune, stay in touch. Yeah. Grow your app coming soon. Yeah. So. Low key. Yo, hey man, you need some production. Bro, got it. Come me in, little bro. Hey man. Hey man. He got that. He got that work, B. <laughs> got that work for that that new pills and that 21 DP. Oh, sure they see so down for me. When it's time to collect, she make them rounds with me. No, I will rock for her. She was there for me. I can count on my back. I can count on my back. Oh, show that she so down for me. When it's time to collect, she make them rounds with me. She know I will rock for her. She was there for me. I can count on my back. I can count on my back. Hold on, they gave him the mic. When he was like, oh shit. Hold on. He checked it. I'm talking to my boy. He checked it. I'm talking to my boy. Yeah, that's what I started laughing about. That's what I started laughing about, yo. Because I forgot who I said it to. I said, that nigga said, he's talking to I'm talking to you. I'm going to fuck up with you, nigga. For real. Look how he's laughing my ass off. Boy, back in my head. I'm out of the video. So we just did the God of Toss. And guess what? No one got it. Go figure. Go figure. And then you heard next. Him the egg. Hey, the you, baby. I thought that. Who went down to me? Jump to me, sing, 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 At the Phoenix Fest. Looking at with family. You know. With my purple bag. <laughs> my purple bag. Y'all yeah. <laughs> yeah, know who the fuck it is. Ace Fam. And when I step up in this bitch, I smash it. Cause that thing I do be classic. Huh. Let me see what time it is. <laughs>
But what we doing? What was up? What did I do to make you get in your feelings? I'm sorry that I'm doing shit for my children. What did I do to make you get so offended? I'm sorry that I'd rather be about my business than kicking. Now what did I do to make you feel a certain way? Was it the chick you saw me with the other day? With that pretty ass face and them titties sitting right and them glossed up lips when you seen us at the light? And I gave you the salute, but you gave the evil eye, huh? Was it that? Long nights in the studios and I forgot to hit you back Or cause I'm spitting them facts shit and you spitting whack shit He's been hooked to me, but then he go into the hook about it like nigga, like yeah. And I'm like, oh shit, that's where I'm at. That's that's perfect. You know what I mean? So yeah, it's about basically shit. People be mad at you for no reason. Well, at least no reason to yourself. And you like, what what I do? You know what I'm saying? I thought we was cool. You know what I'm saying? All of a sudden, calls stop. All of a sudden, motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? They looking at you crazy. You know what I'm saying? The same vibe for some reason. What I do? <laughs> Talk right. to me. Right. So we just going through basically those thoughts, the assumptions. <laughs> is it this? Is it that? Is it that? Is it this? Take off. Regardless, we finna take off. Take off. Shit for my children. What did I do to make you get so offended? I'm sorry that I'd rather be about my business than kicking. Now what did I do to make you feel a certain way? <laughs> Was it the shit you saw me with the other day? With that pretty ass face and them titties sitting right And them glossed up lips when you seen us at the light And I gave you the salute, but you gave the evil eye, huh? Did I hurt you in the process of chasing my dreams? Are you 
day Cause I started thinking less about y'all and more about me That's how I feel, case words go sing Spread out your cash, I'ma spread my wings Take off on them, uh, I'll take off on them uh, I'll take off on them, uh, I'll take off on them, uh, I'll take off on them. Uh. Basically, we sitting here, we like, we like four songs in, right? And uh, I figure we need, it's time to start thinking about the graphics for the, for the shit. So, uh, the name of it is still here. Name of it is still here. And uh, I, we came up with like two, two like, two like, I don't know, two concepts. One of them was like a picture. Cause you know what I'm saying, like our next, all our shits after what we just been doing has to be iconic. That was the whole thing we've been going for. So I was thinking at first was like, it's we next door, we grew up next door neighbors, I should say. So go back to the essence, but uh, showing that we standing in front of it, like, but we still here type shit. So the gate, the gate separates our careers. And I was thinking we like lean in between, well the gate leans in between us while we leaning on it type shit. And you see the background of the crib. And then I was like, what about, because I, I was nervous, like what if that's giving off the impression we still here, like in them houses though, like I didn't want that impression. So I was like, what if, what if we were the buildings, like what if our faces were where we grew up on, oh, you know what I mean, like, like, like looking over it type shit. Right. Or, or. Uh, how we did uh, the tour with the legs. But yeah, something like that. Something like that. Uh, but then I hung up because I was like, well, regardless, what we have to, you wouldn't have nothing to work with if you had no pictures. So I guess we had to figure that out first. But then I thought about, yeah, it makes sense. You know, if you got some concepts that you can think of to, to just go ahead and do it like that too, since you're hearing now what direction we're going for. Yeah, hola, yeah, look, uh. My city feel like Compton back in 88, but shorty wait. This that Texas letter face is better late than never, but we never late. It's perfect timing when the stars are lining. My spirit's illuminating, my soul's an actual diamond. And my girl the finest, all my flows is timeless. This that preparation, even haters press rewinders. No fast forward, press the red recorder. Address me as your highness. I mean, I'm kind of sort of headed to a better place. Post mortal status, heaven gates. The process is to demonstrate through with myself, not delegate. Uh, all right. All right, we're going to start it from, um, after kind of sort of. Some will find it that difficult because it's like, what else can I talk about? What else can I say? Like, I probably talked about this and that like a billion times. Like, what else can I do? And, but with me, I feel like that's that, I know, I found out that that's what's great about what's happening now. Because early on, you know, I, I touch on stuff, but I'm so private, I'm so closed in that I wouldn't give details. I wouldn't tell you my story for real. I give you, you know, basic off the true story type shit. Now you're getting the story. You know what I mean? So I feel like I can't miss anything because I'm being me. No one knows that story and no one can tell it but me.
Got that cut, man. Kool Aid. <laughs> <laughs> Look there. Yeah, that's Kool Aid. Kool Aid, good job. Six months. Six months. Yeah. So, what you got? Six months to a year. Have to go back. Have to go back and see what you're doing. That ink, boy, that do something to you. Once you start, it's just a bit. <laughs> yeah, I'm just leave it up. I just, I'm not done yet. I'm just figuring out what I want because I don't want just anything. You know what I'm saying? That's what's been taking me. Let me see that mic. Let me see that mic, Jelly. Ah, who ready? <laughs> always got the mic in my hand. <laughs> Straight up. Always look open. Yeah, got to. Got to. Last one I got was the sugar deal, my uncle. Nice. I'm ready to get the other one done, but I'm trying to tone his arms up. Yeah, we'll catch up. Watch. Next thing I see. That looks real. You'll be like, oh, shit, I like it now. That was your first one? You went straight in the game with a big ass <laughs> half a slip? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't yeah. know that. How long it took? Oh, it took a couple years. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. Um, initially, it was supposed to be, I don't know, like, four sessions. Huh. But then I started going with that artist. And then the other artist that I had passed away. And it took uh, three eights or two legs? Okay. Three verses.
Bandcamp. Celebration, get us right. We gon' take it to the sky, yeah. Never give up a pass. We don't never let it ride, yeah. They be like, you don't talk. Then I tell them that I'm shy, yeah. It'll never leave me no matter where I'm at. It'll be inside, yeah. We ain't taking shots tonight, it's bottle service. We walk in and see their faces like we got them nervous. Ain't no clowns over here, but it's like a circus. Been stunting for the fuck of it, and now we got a purpose. <laughs> Celebration, yeah, that's right We gon' take it to the sky, yeah Never give up a pass We don't never let it ride, yeah They be like, you don't talk Last day is, I got like two more songs to finish. Hey, them niggas going to get that money. Hey, you already know. I'm just saying. They probably posted up at Home Depot all day, oh, waiting on some work. That's what I be saying about entrepreneurship and the grind and how you got to get it. Like, I just, sure. No problem. No problem. That's what I'm saying. Like, motherfuckers, they ain't got that, that, that mindset, that old get it attitude. Motherfuckers that get free studio time, get free recording, all that shit. They don't show up on time. They don't show up on time. They ain't even having a dime. Meanwhile, they wonder how the fuck is they, you know what I'm saying, why they songs ain't not, why they ain't doing this, why they ain't doing that. Niggas, because your work at the game fair. That's what right. I be telling motherfuckers. Like, that should be killing me. But, ain't no problem with my team. <laughs> <laughs> ain't no problem. Aces, we get it. And I don't know. I, I just feel like it's, it's natural. They ain't trying to beat me or beat me. We all collectively want to get this shit together. So it's like, let's do it together. I love this shit. <laughs> I don't mind, you feel me? Just don't just do too much and mess up the whole city. Let's see what's up, baby. We just wrapped the project and it is crazy. Crazy, crazy. Shut up, man. <laughs> Shut up, man. Ah! <laughs> Straight dope. Man, like, <laughs> we. <laughs> Charles Francis in this bitch. 
Yeah, we killed it with takeoff. Now this one, oh my god. Can't wait for you out of here. Let me hear you say, hey, yeah. 